On today's edition of the news, we're going to talk all about the Micro Galaxy Squadron. Something different for this channel for a change. And also, we have some fan mail, priority mail, all the way from the USA. All this and more coming up. Welcome to my television, your home action figure news. And yesterday I said Micro Galaxy Squadron and it is made by Jazzwares. Now, everything I do on here is Hasbro. So a little logo in the corner of the thumbnail. We're going to put a Jazzwares logo. It's another toy company. You guys collect things from other lines, Mattel, etc. And now we do a little bit of Jazzwares. This line is interesting to me and I thought I'd share you all the information of all the upcoming stuff that's coming out. There's certain sub lines and things to collect. Most of it will be widely available at your Walmarts, your Targets, your, on your Amazons and other shops as well. Here in Australia, most of it is going straight to Aussie Sci-Fi Collectibles. So if you're in country and you want to get some of this stuff, you know where to go. The line is reminiscent of the Micro Machine stuff, which is also owned by Jazzwares. But this is a little bit different. It's a little bit more like Action Fleet. Let's get in to have a look at what they've got. The Assault Class. Now this has one vehicle in it, and that is the centerpiece of the collection, the Millennium Falcon. The one inch figures included are Han Solo, Chewbacca, Princess Leia and Obi-Wan Kenobi. This thing has retractable landing gear, rotating cannons, motion activated lights and sounds, and in you guys in the US, it's a Target exclusive. It presents well in the box. The box has a sticker on it that says launch edition sticker, meaning it's first edition kind of stuff. If you want to collect this and it's and it's successful for years to come, the launch edition stuff is like, you know, first edition, anything first edition is going to be valuable in years to come. So get your hands on this, the centerpiece of the collection, the Millennium Falcon. The next lineup is the Starship class. Now this Starship class has, I believe, three vehicles available at the moment that are on the way, like in the, in the works. There is the Razor Crest, which is the standard version. The standard version is available on Amazon now. I got the links in the description for my Amazon affiliate. I've put it in there. It is not, it's available to pre-order. I don't think it's available to buy yet. It does feature Grogu, Grief, and Dinjarin. And then there's the Avala 7 one, which is the Walmart exclusive. That one there has the Jawa Quill, I never say his name right, Krill, and Mando. And it's a seven inch vehicle, by the way, seven inches of Razor Crest. Also available is the Boba Fett Starship not Slave One. It is a Walmart exclusive and comes with Boba Fett and Fennec Shan. Then there's a transport class. Now this one here I like because it's got the Imperial Troop Transport, one of my favorite vehicles from all of Star Wars. They said it's based on the old, old version, which obviously is the one that was never seen on screen, but uh, seen in comic books. And as we've seen, redone in later years as it appeared in The Mandalorian. This is a Walmart exclusive. Very cool, comes with a couple of Stormies. Lovely. There's the Starfighter class. Darth TIE Fighter Advance. And the Luke X-Wing. The Luke X-Wing is also available in a chase, one of 5,000. Something tempting to get into the line, collecting chases. The light armor class has the ATST Raider, Clatoonian Raider, and there's also the regular one with the driver as well. A couple of variations in the paint. The TIE Fighter, there is one available in the black, and the other one is available in the white, which is what we saw back in the Kenner days. They did a white version. This is also a 1 in 5000 chase. Very nice. Also in the light armor class is the Assange Ventress Ginevex Starfighter which is from Clone Wars. Interesting selection, nice a nice deep cut there. Looks quite impressive. The Scout class is the fun stuff. This is mystery packs, you just go in there and buy a box. I think they're $5.99 in the US. You can get a collection of either Mando, Ahsoka, Biker Scout, a clone, Darth Maul, they're all there in the set. And for the time being, that is your Micro Galaxy Squadron collection. Due out later this year, I hope you're happy looking at those because I was thought I haven't talked about them yet in any videos and I thought I'll make a whole video just of that stuff. There have been other YouTubers doing videos on this stuff already. Looks like a very interesting lineup. It does pretty much cover OT, 
right up to present day Star Wars. So it's going to go across all lines. So let me know what you think about the Micro Galaxy Squadron. Are they for you? Are you going to add them to your collection? The reason I'm liking them, I don't see any packaging that is plastic free. So lovely big open windows if you want to keep them in box like I do to most of my stuff. I'm loving this line. Anyway, let's get to some fan mail all the way from the USA, as I said before. Yeah, priority mail. This is very expensively posted. I, I thank you very much, Brian. Find him on Instagram at TK6287. Thank you very much, my friend. We'll crack into this now, see what he sent. If you would like to send anything to the channel, it is up on the screen there, PO Box 957, Elizabeth 1 New South Wales 2480 Australia. And look how well packed it is. Dun, dun, dun. Tight in there. He reached out and said he's sending something, but we have a note. We have a note. Oh, and some really cool patches I can see. <laughs> Hello, Mike. I've also enclosed a couple of goodies from my 501st Garrison. One is from the squadron I belong to, and the other is a variant of our Golden Gate Garrison logo. I hope you like them. Thank you all for the work you do on your videos. I really enjoy them. Take care, my friend. Brian, TK2687. And I saw them first in the Ziploc bag. Let me get them out. <laughs> he's even got his own... He's even got his own trading card. How about that? Unreal. And there is his face on the back. Thank you, Brian. That is outstanding. You're, you're staying in the collection. The Golden State Garrison 501st Legion. Ooh, look at that. Focus, camera, focus. Look at that. That's brilliant. Look at that. Because when I think Golden Garrison, Golden Gate Garrison, yeah, San Francisco. And this one, the Golden Gate Garrison, South Bay Squad, 501st Legion. Oh, how nice is that? The Death Star on there. Brilliant. Now, we have the, the figure in here. That is well packed. How good is that? Boxed, bubble wrapped, paper wrapped, and now we're in a padded envelope. <laughs> <laughs> Layers of protection. What a legend. Oh. <laughs> Are you ready, everybody? Look at this. <laughs> Fett. It is Boba Fett in his prototype armor. Orange head version. I know there's a bunch of versions out there, but I'm just happy to own one. I love this line. It is... People tend to hate it because I just like the aesthetic of it being on card as being pop art very Andy Warhol like I like this sort of styling and prototype figures when you think about prototype figures they're like the rarest of rarest and I'll never own a prototype figure obviously but yes I can own a prototype figure because they've made them like this yeah the original prototype figures go for a mozza online so prototype figures now we have three to the collection that is bloody brilliant thank you very much Brian you are a legend. How good is that? Thank you, Brian. You've added to the collection Boba Fett prototype, Stormy's on here, and the Darth Vader. I believe the only one that, look, no sticker. We had special edition, retro collection, no sticker, Chewie's on the way, and the Luke is on the way as well. Don't know what their stickers are gonna look like. Excellent stuff. Thank you so much. I hope you've enjoyed today's video, all about the Micro Galaxy Squadron, and the unboxing from Brian. Thank you for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Here's my outro. Thanks for watching. My name is Usual Mike. If you enjoyed this content, consider being a member of the channel and hit that join button below. You might like to pick something up from Amazon in the affiliates link down below. And also there is a link to my Redbubble store so you can pick up some merch with my logos on it. If you want to follow me on social media, I'm on Twitter at UsualMike30 or on Instagram at UsualMikeTV. And if you haven't done so already, hit subscribe. Tap that little bell for notifications. Slap a like on the video if you've enjoyed it. And I'll see you guys next time. All the best. <laughs>